the research process. The research process has seven steps. The first step is to find the problem. Here you choose something that's very general, something that's very broad, such as drug abuse. Then you want to review all the literature as it pertains to drug abuse. Things you want to find out here is what is drug abuse? How pervasive is drug abuse? What are the reasons why people abuse drugs? What are the drugs that are more often abused? Who are generally abusers? How does drug abuse affect the individual? How does drug abuse affect society? Once you have all that information, you're not able to formulate a hypothesis. A hypothesis is simply an educated guess, which means now that you have your topic drug abuse, you want to narrow that down and you may narrow it down very simply by asking a question, who abuses drugs or is drug abuse on the rise or what is society doing to curve drug abuse if society is doing anything to address the problem. Then you want to select a research design. A research design here very simply is you're taking a look at the type of research you want to do, how you plan to conduct your research, how are you going to, are you going to do uh, interviews, are you going to do surveys, who are you going to interview, are you going to interview people randomly, is there going to be a specific method to how you choose your interviewees, are you going to be doing um, historical research. So this is where you do all the planning. And this stage, I would like to see this stage as a map. And with a map, the map tends to show you where you are and where you're going and how you're going to get there. Then the time comes that you actually carry out the research. After you've concluded with the research, you want to interpret your results. There are different measures for interpreting your results and the main modes of interpreting your results come through using either qualitative methods or quantitative methods. Qualitative methods is basically providing summaries of your findings, whereas qualitative me methods are quantifying your actual results. And finally, you want to report your research findings. And this, in essence, is the research process.